if I remember correctly, chapter 11 is where um, we get the second um, Carter mission. Oh yeah, we're actually pretty close to that. Yeah, we are getting close to that. Actually, I think we're just, we're about to go into the cutscene again. Do you want to skip this cutscene, or do you want to watch it again? Let me skip it. Let me skip it. I don't yeah. think we can. Oh. Unskippable cutscenes, great. Good to see you made it, nice. Isaac. Yeah, maybe we should give you two some time alone, huh? Nor. What the hell does that mean? It means for someone who's in the past, you're awfully glad to see him. We need him. This mission needs Come on, him. We need him or you need him. You got something to say to me, Captain? Stop. How many years Stop. have passed between two and we three? Need I forget. To shut down that damn machine, and we don't even know where it is yet. Between two and three? Yes. I mean, I think I know how to find it. I have no idea. Well, I don't remember I back that far. Left of the research notes. That's fine. That because what computer data yet? this guy's been with Ellie maybe one, two years. He's like so defensive of her. The machine's exact location. Well, I think if we repeat it, we can do the same. But it's like how Isaac should be Sorry, like acting I could use a change of if he wanted to act that way. Like, he should have more of a connection to Ellie than that guy. He really guy. should. You know that? So, if anybody should have, like, conniptions, it should be, uh, Isaac. It's almost like they're completely alien, alien to each other. But guess what we can do? This is what we, guess what we can do again. <laughs> oh, okay. So that's how you do that. I was trying to remember. It's been a couple days. Um, inventory. We got this door open again. Still weird. Okay, so inventory got to do something. Well, <clears throat> once you get inventory done, you can come over here and get some more goodies. Because I opened the door again. Oh. Do do do. Actually, let me just go over there. I mean, most of it's materials. There's a couple like health packs, maybe, but most of it's just like uh, transistors and stuff like that. I'm gonna put some stuff away while you're doing that. Maybe make a couple more pork torque bars in case we need them. Wait, I actually need to bring a few things out of the, the safe. I actually used a lot of health store in that mission. Oh, there we go. The boss. Yeah. Craft uh, torque bar. I got six now. Should be should be good for a while. <laughs> Are you in this room? Yeah. Door closed. Oh, you're not in this room. Oh. Oh, you're over there. How did you, you got past me? The stomp is just so loud when he stomps. Funny enough, there's still a few more necromorphs left to introduce in the game. We, have, we still have a few more. It feels like there's so much is not that much has actually happened in the game, doesn't it? Not really. Let's see: electrifies projectiles to cause small amounts of voltaic damage. Increase That's clip, actually pretty. Good. Increases clip size for self and partner. Also, I have one for medic. I had the medic one as well. If I heal myself while you have damage, I'll he also heal you. I'm gonna put that one on. I'm pretty sure you can do both. I think you can do both, right? You can put one on the bottom part and one on the top. You can make your, your gun shoot electric, like, do electrical damage. That's what my sniper I have full has. My sniper has electrical damage. So my mm -hmm. machine gun and the sniper do the same damage. I think you can put the heal thing at the top and like the electric thing in the middle, and that'll be fine.
Oh, I'm supposed to be looking at the upper part. Never mind. So, upper part... Not so much. crazy stuff with these guns too it's just a shame that uh, the guns from the original games aren't as like powerful as the ones they get to make yourself the plasma cutter just they say it's a brick wall when it comes to damage after a while the other games you could pretty much beat the whole games with the plasma cutter okay so you were right I could actually put the uh, ammo thing on the other attachment so now both oh. of our clip sizes should be bigger. Not bad, not bad. Let's see. I usually just sell off med, uh, small ones. I keep them just so that I can just spam little heals when I'm getting beat up by enemies. You can sell them for a material, but I think the only material you get from that is the stuff that makes them. The gel. Each of the each of the items gets a certain amount of uh, gets a certain amount of parts you get from them. Ah. I could be wrong though. Like making making the heal kits is actually quite cheap. I think it's like 200 gel to make a large one or a medium. One of the two. It's really cheap to make the to make the heals. Where is that custom blueprint? Oh, I could actually make that me? weapon that you made custom. Oh, the sniper? The sniper rifle? Seeker rifle. Heavy standard seeker yeah. rifle, a flamethrower. Yeah, just immediately take off the scope if you do, because the scope is awful. The scope they give you with the thing is really bad, so immediately take that off of it if you do build it. You don't have to, except if you want to. Is it good? It's been pretty good for me. It's a very accurate weapon, so if you miss, it takes a little bit, a couple seconds to shoot again, but I've been doing pretty good with it. I always have this, the plasma cutter as my, like, backup weapon. I'm gonna make it. Sure. I mean, you can attach the machine gun parts or something onto that as well. True. Sure. So let me look at that. Yeah, it's, it's... The crafting stuff in this is interesting. It's not, like, I'm not a big fan of the way the upgrades work for it, but I like, the crafting stuff's pretty fun. You should make some pretty crazy weapons. Wait, so that means I have to take the medic support off of the other gun? Yeah, you'd have to take the medic support off and the ammo thing, put on the other one. So I'll put stasis support on the other one. Stasis support's really good. If I remember correctly, that means every, sh when you shoot an enemy, it takes stasis, they, like, they start to freeze up a little bit, like, they couple seconds of stasis. Not very long, but it slows them down pretty considerable. That's what I have on my plasma cutter. So if you hit them with it, it'll just slow them down enough to just keep shooting them. Um, that's not what the description said, though. It was just stasis it, support. Oh, you no, know, it, it probably... I'm probably wrong. There's, there's probably like a thing where there's probably multiple stasis things. Yeah, stasis packs consumed by self, also recharge partner. Ah, oh, okay. And you said to take what? off the scope? Well, sh look at the scope yourself. It, it, like, pull, it, like, it's weird with the scope of this thing. Um, check it for yourself. If you, if you like it, that's fine. But if you don't, you should probably take it off. What do I have on my... Oh, I have a stasis coating. That's what it is. That's what it is. I have stasis coating. It's the attachment I have. My bad. Sorry about that. Do you like the scope? What's, what did you attach to it? Hmm? What did you attach to the bottom? What is that? Machine gun? No, it's flamethrower. Oh, cool. I had the flamethrower when I started that. that. Sniper, it's a sniper flamethrower. 
Did you take the scope off or you keep it on it? Uh, I think I'll keep it on it for now. Okay. And then the other one has just weird stasis today. support. Okay. <coughs> Man. Hey, wait for Isaac. Isaac, we're just outside. <laughs> and we're freezing. Hurry your ass up. Yeah. Why is it one over here? Gotta find where the oh, robot is. One over here. It's in this door. Oh. I wonder where we'll be going. Now remember, you walk fast if you pull your gun up. That's true. <laughs> it's so weird. Oh man, it's just a nice, bright, sunny day on this ice planet. Too bright. Can't look at that. Look, all the NPCs are just standing there. <laughs> immediately tried to shoot them. <laughs> I tried to. Uh, you know, in any situation, I would Everybody never take my hand. No point would I ever take my helmet off. Men find us. Come on. Come on. Run. Look how Norton is the one asking that. Was that not Norton who did who asked that question? What? I may have been wrong about that. He asked, how did Norton, how did Danzig's people find us? I thought Norton was the one who asked that. I think so. And it's just moving slightly. Oh, else we can do this. There we go. Get my little robot out here. I have another one. I have two of them. You got two of them now? Really yeah. Cool. I don't know where I got that. Yeah, it, it, like the first one's like, oh man, it's so cool, look at this thing. And the second one's like, yeah, well you just got a second one now. It's just some random point, you just get a second one. You got three of them all together in the game. Ah. Where did they come from? They must have came Where did they go? That's impossible. Not through shock space. Yeah. Well, Where do they come from? Ellie, Where do they go? <laughs> they Where do they come from? <laughs> Cotton Eye Joe. Ellie. Of the game, I just kind of forget where the items are, but I think there was one around here somewhere. Might be in a, like all these areas kind of look the same. There was like two There's items, snow. but yeah, it wasn't anything important though. Not really. Now remember, these people defeated the entire military. So always remember that when you fight these guys. These people defeated EarthGov. <laughs> run, run, run. Well, yeah, they ran right into Necromorphs. I remember uh. correctly. Because they want to be Necromorphs. They love them so much. I hear something slithering around. This dude just kind of... Yay. 
kills them pretty fast. You see I... this guy's just sitting here? Yeah. I think I shot him. Yeah, if you shoot him in the legs, when they die, they just kind of fall over. Oh, that's weird. I mean, it's only logical. If somebody shoots you in the leg, you're dead. Yep. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. Game over, man. Game over. Shot to the hand is deadly. Brick, get used to this thing. We go through these little things. Ellie, double open. Everyone all right? Yeah, I think we're safe. We are anything but safe. They're after Isaac, and we're getting caught in the crossfire. Look, the warehouse. The signal tracking experiment should be inside. You're not worth as much trouble, Clark. Directed suspension field. Go from one little box to another. That's in case you had to build more items. For your, like if you had, if you ran out of weapon rares, build more items. Oh. Which of these incredibly long super bottom difficult. These guys do not do well against tech people. They almost all just do That guy just ran straight up to us. what they wanted. They want to become Necromorphs. They should be like, ah, oh, cool, my savior. Exactly. Little spot right here. I think there might be maybe there might be a artifact in this little area, but I could be wrong. So far a whole lot of nothing. Might just be for items from that thing. Oh. Yep, nothing. That sucks. It's this way. The tunnel! He's in the tunnel! <laughs> like we have the technology to. Seven times. <laughs> I thought it was just airy, just whatever, just run right through them. Right here. Oh. Jeez, I never picked that one up. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you? You're supposed to collect them all. Gotta collect them all. It is a requirement. Oh, wow. <laughs> Thank you. Get off my head. Here, I'll help you. Oh, look at this. Oh, does it? Is, it? is your plan to die? Is that your plan? But for that to happen, Isaac Clark must die. The future of our religion, of our very race, depends upon it. Stop him at any cost. <laughs> 
<laughs> this one man will be destruction upon our religion. He must be destroyed. This is um, Nado's levels of uh, logic. Hmm. There's an item we can grab over there. Hammond's heavy oh. frame. Or I must have already picked that one up. Yeah, you might already. I think I'm ready to pick that one up already. It's always annoying when I I don't know like you pick up an item, I was like, did I pick that up yet? This is the only way he could have come. Be ready. <laughs> If they throw a grenade, you can throw it back at him. Yeah, I figured as much. That's what you do in Halo. There's one more around there. I think so. I thought I remember there one being one more. How's your, how's your health doing? Really good. Totally fine. Oh, there's another little nook and cranny over here. <laughs> it's impossible. It's, a, it's invincible. <laughs> Die, you nerd. He's actually getting up. <laughs> really? Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> it won't die. Look, look, you just gotta stop. You just gotta stop. <laughs> so yeah, do you remember the monsters? The um, I forget what they're called. They were like a bunch of parts put together. Yeah, they don't exist in this game. Just the head. That's so shit. You remember the the, the monster? If there was like a whole bunch of different parts, like arms and legs and stuff. Yeah, it was awesome. And it's really unique. Yeah, like this really unique growl that doesn't exist in this game. Like a lot of enemies, this that one does not exist. It should. Just the head. Just the head. The head was the only one important, right? Hell. That's dumb. They're dumb. Um. Oh yeah, there's a. Uh, what are they called? Hive mines. There's a bunch of hive mines around. Ah. Oh, one of those guys, man. <sighs> Just throw them. Oh, there's... that's a good weapon for those things. I, how... I forget how many it takes to make a monster and freak to come back to life. Ha <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, did I actually punch it or did Ooh. you throw it to the ground? No, you got it. You punched it. Oh, cool. Good job. <laughs> Very good. Very good job. Do we have to do this yet or uh Gotta do this first. <laughs> oh I can actually punch it in midair. Yeah. It's over here. <laughs> is it nothing? I think this is one of the side missions. This is not I don't I don't think this is your side mission, but I could be wrong. Hmm. There is a side mission we can do a little bit. We have to find a key card in one of these areas. And it's like a tra it's a station. Uh, I think something just happened because this music just got. Oh, what the? <laughs> what a jerk. I was like, uh oh, there's something happening. The music's getting bad. <laughs> and he immediately hit you in the back. Go down. Oh my god. One more. There we go. There we go. That wasn't too bad. No. I like how Arma Communicators has any idea of where we're going. What the hell is that? Oh no. Looks like a drill. Oh no. This is gonna be fun. We have to go inside the thing. There's a part right here for you. We have to go Did inside the hive mind. Yeah, we do. Oh, there's my little guy. Let me turn this off. Yeah, we go. Boring platform online. Attention all hands. Obstruction Alright, you got anything you want to put away or anything before we go into this next little area? Yeah, I gotta check it out. See what's going on. If I remember correctly, there's an achievement slash like trophy or whatever associated with this next part. Basically, beat this entire part without getting hit once. Well, let's see. That would be a lot of damage lower. Speed would be slower. So it would be a lot of clip. No. Yeah, it takes a while to get the good um, thing. Like, they start you out with some really bad ones. Okay, so clips I could do. I'll just do the plus so ones. And then reload. Reload plus rate of fire? I could do even more damage.
So I can do reload or plus damage or reload plus rate of fire. Well, rate of fire would make you be able to fire the sniper rifle more if you do that one. Yeah. Remember, whatever damage you put in, it'll be whatever. Like if you put it in the top one, it'll do more damage to the top one. But it won't affect the bottom part, the bottom weapon. So always remember, there's no real point of putting anything in the bottom weapon. Like for, this, for the uh, plasma rifle, there's really no reason to put anything in the bottom part. It doesn't affect anything, unfortunately. Hmm. Oh, wait, 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 I can actually do the fourth slot. Okay. I didn't think I was able to, but yeah, I could do the rate of fire as well. So, reload and rate of fire. Or I can do the last slot. That sounds clip. pretty good. But that's minus one reload. Oof. Nah, should do reload. Reload makes sense. Hey, get, that, get the gun back to firing status as quickly as possible. Shoot more people's. Yeah, so that makes sense. Okay, so let me go look at what I have on me. I'll put the three small ones away for now. So I have four small stasis. Nah, I'll put the stasis away. Okay, so four medium med pet yeah, med kits and four ammo things. Sounds good. Okay. All right. You ready for this one? Yeah. All right, you grab one side. Now you're gonna fight the drill. Fight the drill. I really thought that was it. <laughs> what kind of drill yeah. is that? <laughs> Fuck <Dude>. this planet. <laughs> what? Let's get out of here. <laughs> okay, Ellie. We're headed to the warehouse now. Is everything okay? Oh, yeah. Between this planet trying to kill us, your boyfriend hating me, this has been a wonderful trip so what? far. Not usually like this. I don't know why. He... Just let us fight it out, okay? One of us will win eventually. Yep. Did you find the experiment? Yes. And? You'll just have to see it. Oh, good. Isaac's just like, oh. just let us fight it out. <laughs> I'll win eventually, lady. Got a lot of stuff on that. Yeah, that part's really hard to get the achievement. As you can see, it's the constant of. It's the constant stream of enemies. 
makes that part hard. Yeah. Like, I forgot how to do the drill, but once we realized the drill was pretty easy to take out. Oh, something there. Oh, oh well. It was just ammo. So I figured. Yeah, there's a little spot right here. Yep, right on top of yours. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. There's so many deads. And healed me too. That's good. And I meant to do it. It was all me. <laughs> How many of these doors are we going through at this point? Like seven? Yeah, seven or nine. Oh man, it's a, it's a, it's a, what should we call it? It's a hive mind. Isaac, there you are. We're upstairs on the observation level. What the hell is this? It's bad news, that's what it is. Beautiful, isn't it? The scientists called it the Nexus. They thought these bigger specimens acted as conduits for the machine's control signal, broadcasting it to the smaller forms. And that helps us out? Because I think they found the machine by tracking the signal upstream through nerve clusters inside the creature. Oh, well, wait. We need to get inside that thing? Yes! This is such a wonderful opportunity! Oh, I know. The son of a bitch is frozen solid. How do we get in? The scientists use heat exchangers. Let me try to ignite them. No, no good. There's probably a furnace on the roof. If I can find it, I can get it running again. Isaac, be careful up there, alright? Yeah, yeah, don't hurt yourself. <laughs> <laughs> so our objective is to bring this thing back to life, go inside of it, and shoot little pods into it or something. Why? Personal luck. Because the Nexus experiment is well, it's incredible. We have discovered two nearly pristine specimens, and crews are working around the clock to uncover them. We're learning so much about how these necromorphs communicated. The whole species seems to have been connected by some telepathic signal from the lowliest foot soldier to the mightiest specimen. But where is the signal coming from? That is what I intend to find out. I like how they're trying to, like, study necromorphs in this game. Hmm. It new always suit ends available. well. It always ends well. I have a new suit available all of a sudden? That's incredible. Strange. I don't remember what suit it could be. I mean, you can always check it. Oh, wait, do you have a suit machine here? Yeah, it's right there. Yeah. Archaeologist suit? I think for Isaac, that one's really weird looking. But I don't know what Carter's looks like. Oh yeah, you don't find the suits. They just Gage just goes, I hear you got a suit now. Have it. There you go, put it on. Aside from like the Arctic one, all the other suits are just kind of given to you at one point. That's strange. Looks like a red version of mine. He's got the little. The Haven has the visor on it. It's up to you if you want that one or the other one. Whichever one you prefer. I'll probably stick with it for a while. Yeah, that's fine. Wait, you like the visor or the other one? Ah, this one's fine too. They're both pretty good. There's not a very large amount of suits in this game, unfortunately. Like I said, two has a lot of good suits, this one not so many. Mm. 
There we go. Update of those. Oh, you can also. Did you upgrade yourself? Yeah. I don't like it. I like it. I'm going back. I gotta admit, the first suit that Carter comes in is actually a pretty good suit. Yeah. I think that one looks a little bit too much like Isaac. Yeah, it has to have like a different different personality or something. Yeah, I like this one better. That one just was too much like Isaac's. Oh, did I check over there? No, I did not. There's a couple like uh, bullets or something like over there. <laughs> <laughs> I only ever roll for fun in this game. I don't think I've ever really rolled for like to get out of the way or anything like that. Yeah. I can't move. I can't move. I'm actually stuck. Exactly. I got you now. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. It's gonna let you out. Dang it. Darn it. <laughs> <laughs> I almost got you. <laughs> we shoot the boxes at each other. Um. Can I shoot my box at your box? Yeah, oh. You can. Yeah, you can. We need to get this battery out of here, I think. Yep. And we'll eventually have to bring it over there to put it inside of there. Dead. <laughs> Wait, another one? It was another one. No. We're pretty far into the game. We haven't seen any, like the super deck force yet. I like how that one just walked right past me. Yeah. Weird. We got another one of these coming out. Hmm? We're over here. Yeah, it's right here. Oh my gosh. It's all the parts. <laughs> I threw it over there. Now I just gotta get to the damn thing. Understood. Okay. Yeah, you gotta slip. You gotta slip it inside. I mean, to go around. Oh, okay. Actually, you, maybe, I don't know if you could have actually shot it into it. I tried to. For a second, I thought the necromorph's body was moving around. Like it was freaking out or something. It was actually the little robot pushing them through the body. Oh. Oh, you're already up there. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're gonna have a couple more enemies coming at us. Never mind. First time I got to this level, I actually got a little lost here because the the uh, the battery was so inconspicuous. I didn't think you could actually push that button, but then it's like, oh, you can push the button. You know, that's how you get through this little area. But I couldn't oh. find the battery for a little while. Plus two right, negative one, clip. Ah. I hate this. Oh, 
hate that. I hate, I hate getting negative ones. <sighs> yeah, they're kind of like, you can only have your positive if you have a negative. <laughs> What's the chances of us walking down this, this uh, long stretch of wall without getting attacked again? Very good. Don't look, don't look left or right like a lion. <laughs> I'm actually fairly surprised that there any more enemies spawn to attack us when we're going back to this thing. That's not the day at the space way. You usually have enemies in the front and then enemies come back. I cannot wait to get to your side mission because that's gonna be a lot of fun. Why is that? Because the thing you'll it'll be a lot more obvious how different the, the screens are gonna be when we get to that point. Ah, it's gonna be very different. Wait, tell me to go back upstairs. Oh, it does. Why? That's a good question. We do something wrong. I don't know. Probably didn't push the button, that's why we, didn't, we, get, we weren't attacked again. There was oh. probably a button that we had to push or something like that, I don't know. Put the thing in, I thought we were done. <laughs> Let me wait this long, long elevator up again. I like I like being a stoic uh, eyes and then turn around and see Carter rolling in the background. <laughs> <laughs> Dead Space 3 is a horror game. Turn around and he's rolling all over the place. Yeah. Hey, right, game, tell me what I'm supposed to do. Do barrel roll. Go back upstairs, huh? This is hey, the only the way to travel. Was there a switch up top or something? Oh. Uh, um. Look at this. Push the button. Oh, okay. Got it. So, oh man, they were behind me the whole time. What a surprise! Enemies came after us when we when we did the thing. <laughs> They're smart. They learned. Clever girl. It would have been more interesting if they didn't attack us. Like, it was, oh man, it actually didn't attack us for once after we did something. But no, no, it went the obvious route. Watch roll. Where, where did that guy come from? Are you all right? uh, the other side. I was like hearing noises. And I, I was like, is he on the right side? No, he's on the left side. And he ran past me, like where I thought he was, and then went after you. Ways. But you need me for the mission, and that's why I'm here. That plus, well. Frankly, I hope. Ellie, is that Isaac? Great, great. You two having a nice little chat? Uh, he just called to say he got the furnace going. He's on his way back now. Isaac, I'll see you soon. <sighs> well, time to go back. I think you actually ever, like, see I, what Serrano looks the like. The heat exchangers are powered up now, hmm. but the specimen isn't thawing. Is there something wrong with the mechanism? Yeah, I think it's frozen shut. I may be able to work it free by adjusting the pressure in the pipes. Hang on. Like, you hear his voice, you hear him talking, but you never actually see Serrano any sort of cutscene or anything. I don't remember what to do. Yeah, what's going on? Uh, push the button and then... Oh, it's four first. We need to go to number four. Oh. See the, see the button will light? Here's what you do. You tell me what button to, to go for and I'll switch it I'll switch it around. Okay, four. So four first. I can just get over here. 
Uh, four. Oh, you want me to just press the button? Yeah, I'll do that. Four. Four. What am I doing wrong here? Three. It push. You have to hold three. Oh me. You do three. Oh one. But there's do one. And then three. Two. Three. Four. One. Two. Four. What a fun and engaging puzzle. I love this puzzle. Three? Yeah, what, what is happening? Heating up the thing so we can we can make the monster come back to life. Hmm. Are we good? Yes. Whoa. I think that did it. Oh. Yes. The internal temperature is rising, and I have more good news. Oh boy. Yes. Come up to the observation booth. I'll explain it all the way. The necromorphs are conduits for the marker's signals. Well, the researchers built a sensor to track that signal upstream to find the machine. So where's the sensor? Probably destroyed. But I did find the blueprints to make a new one. Oh. Hey, remember in the first game where the marker actually repelled the necromorphs? Yeah. The necromorphs actually didn't want to go near the marker? Yeah, that's not the thing anymore. Now the necromorphs...